What's going on, everybody? Q here, Retro Q Gaming. Back with another late night continuation of Super Mario Odyssey. Now, real quick before we get started, I'm just going to fire up the stream chat here because I'm doing things a little bit differently tonight. Here we go. And live. Perfect. So, this gives us the perfect opportunity to get going into Super Mario Odyssey. Pick up from where we left off. And apparently I have a friend online, probably also playing Mario. Well, Nintendo really wants me to play with the Joy-Cons. Which is not happening. And for some reason, I just... You, you can't skip this screen by the looks of it. Super Mario Odyssey! It seems it's basically just a loading screen. So really quick, I'm going to look at the action guide. We probably have everything covered so far. Oh, snapshot mode. I haven't even given that a try yet. So let's see. Reset camera, pause, throw cap, jump. Oh, there's a first person view. Click into... That's handy. That's good to know. Click into right stick. Okay, so far it seems like nothing we don't already know. Basic actions. Long jump we have. Roll we have. Ground pound. Dive. Uh, press ZL and Y while falling in the air. Okay. Kind of handy. Ground pound jump we've already figured out. Capture we already have. Upward throw. Shake. Joy-Cons upwards. I really hope there's a... There's a way to do some of these without Joy-Cons because that one doesn't seem to have a that one doesn't seem to have a like a physical button input, and I don't really want to get pigeonholed into using them. Shake downwards. Let's see, snap to the left and right or the sides. We have the we have the yeah we've got the the cap throw and hold and the cap jump. We've got the homing cap throw. We've got the backward somersault. Although that's the standing backward somersault. We can, yeah. Uh, the side somersault. This is the one we've we've been doing previously. Triple jump, we already have with the proper timing. Wall jump, we already know. Hold and throw. Press Y. Okay, I think we have used that. Swim, we already know. Quick swim. Oh, that's handy to know. Uh, rotate, we haven't done, but we sure as hell will. Dash, we already know. Enter pipes. Uh, okay, so it looks like we've got all the controls. So let's continue on. Now, real quick, I need to know if the volume is okay for this one because I've I rechanged the the layout for my room specifically to play Mario for the stream and beyond. But I just need to make sure the microphone level is good. I'm not too far away or whatever. So, we're back in desert land. Oh, who are these guys? You weren't here before. Oh, wow. Uncle Amiibo. Well, we all know what this is for. <laughs> if you happen to have them, if you happen to have some, put them to work. They're good at finding any stray power moons. And here's the kicker. Depending on the Amiibo you use, you might get a little bonus costume too. You want to tap an Amiibo? No. Because I don't have any Amiibos in this room. They're elsewhere. If you ever want to use an Amiibo, just let me know. Okay. Oh, we got a Toad as well. Why did A jump? Come on. Hi, Mar. Oh, it's the Hint Toad. To help out Princess Peach, I'm doing a survey of Power Moon locations. Having trouble finding Power Moons? I can help you for 50 coins. Want to buy? No, I, I'm going to do this myself. Damn Toads. Look up, what is, is that the, is that the upside down pyramid that we had previously? Now, oh, wait a minute, we've already, no, we finished the desert world, didn't we? Yeah, we've got all the power moons. We had just finished it previously and, oh no, apparently we haven't. The Odyssey needs 16 more. 
Unless this might be the 16. Is this enough? Is this enough? The Odyssey is powered up. Okay, it's good to know that the sound is good, Paul. Thank you for that. I, I readjusted everything so that I was in a much better position, much more comfortable position to be able to play the game, read the text, and, well, just enjoy the whole thing in general. But yeah, the motion controls kind of annoys me. I don't like it to be forced in there. But from what I noticed when I was looking through the menu, there was only a handful. So let's see. Oh, we've hit a proverbial fork in the road. Which kingdom do you think Bowser went to? Hmm. The Wooded Kingdom or the Lake Kingdom? Well, we've already seen something kind of similar to the Wooded one. I want to see what the Lake one looks like. This is probably going to be gorgeous. The Lake Kingdom. A splendid idea. So let's see what our trip to the Lake Kingdom looks like. What up, Kai? Welcome. Did you get the notification this time? Or just from the from the text? Just casually soaring through the air in a... In like a clockwork mechanical hat. He kidnapped Tiara, and now this binding band. He's got a wedding ring. Is he going to steal a whole wedding? Seeing as how we've got some time to kill, let's review some useful skills. Homing cap troll. Well, we already know this one. After throwing your cap shaker pro- Yeah, we've we've already done this. We remember this one. Next, let's read up on the lake. It says they're known for their fashion and, oh, there's this famous wedding gown there called the Lock Lady Dress. Obviously, a lock's a lake, so... How am I enjoying the game and how would you rate two previous Mario games? Well, so far I think the game is fantastic. There's no denying that whatsoever. I have literally no problems and issues with the game as it is at the moment. I, I don't think I'm far enough to compare it to Mario games, but just as a, as a quick general overview, it's certainly up there with some of the best. I don't know, I was thinking Cappy might have been a boo. I actually mistook him for a boo the very first time we saw him. And holy crap, this place is sparkly. I was expecting the entire thing to be underwater. Oh, how convenient. The purple coins are... They're essentially like water drops. Oh, a stack of coins. Come here, coins. They just kept bouncing away. There's a something hidden. Probably a, a moon? I was going to say a star. Oh, this one is pink. Are they just different colors for different, different areas? They must be. Because the first ones were yellow, the second ones were green, and now these ones are pink. Whoa, is this what the inhabitants of the country look like? Or the, what is it, the world? My goodness, that monster's minions just stomped in here uninvited. And they stole our kingdom's finest lock lady dress. It's a tragedy. Well, don't worry, we got that covered. I just noticed it's cool that when I'm, when I'm swimming, look at the, it's like a rainbow effect on the water. What was the quick swim? There it is. It's left bump, or left trigger, or left shoulder button, whatever you want to call it. ZL. I don't like the name of the, the Nintendo ones. What an odd stone. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to be able to butt stomp that one. Stone certainly is peculiar, it doesn't seem to do anything. Well, yeah, but we have to find a way to break it or push it out of the way. I'm going to go with break it. Now, where's a T-Rex when we need one? 
What? Was that a little... Oh, okay. It was a little arrow to tell me I could get up on top of it. Let's take a look around at least, anyway. I do see some purple coins way, way off in the distance. And yeah, actually, that's a good point, Kai. They do kind of look more like fish scales. I was thinking of more the, the outside shape that looked like a water drop. But when you look at the stuff in the middle, they do kind of look like fish scales. Oh, so this is something. I was wondering what it was. Oh, wow. It's a z You can unzip the ground. Oh, what is this, Zelda? It sounded like the Zelda noise. Go down. Oh. Swim. No. Wrong button. I can't. I got it. I couldn't do a fast swim there. That was kind of annoying. You got a moon. Taking notes. Dive and swim. I still haven't mastered the dive. It's it's kind of annoying. Let me get back to the surface just so I can... So if I'm swimming around, I stay on the surface. If I stop, do I sink? Yeah, okay. I got it. I got it. That's going to come in handy. And we are going to take this opportunity to look around. Brutals over the lake. Stack of Goombas. So there doesn't seem to be too much from here, at least. Well, we'll, we'll continue on. Now we have to figure out how to get over the wall. It broke into stairs in the water pass. Okay, we, we saw that. There's another zipper on the wall. <laughs> this is so cool. You just unzip stuff, unzip the walls. Oh, we're gonna have to wall jump up. Oh! I almost missed it. Thankfully, wall jumping in Mario games is significantly easier than it is in Super Metroid. Super Metroid, the only hard parts in Super Metroid are super jump parts or wall jump parts because the wall jumping in that game is fucking hard as nails if you're looking for the water plaza the way is right behind me okay uh where is my zip oh here it is it kind of reminds me of the whole zip thing kind of reminds me of yoshi's woolly world or Kirby's Epic Yarn. So let's go in the next one. Welcome. Welcome to the stream again, Matt. Welcome back. Let's drop down. There's something. Is this a cappy? Oh no, they're air bubbles. What is this? Sonic the Hedgehog? We. We. We, we've grew up on on these games. We know what spikes do. Let's go. And of course, it's got very calming underwater music. Looks like I chose the right way to go, at least. Treasure in the spiky waterway. I noticed there's significantly less moons on this this world, this kingdom. And what is this? It's seaweed. It's enemy seaweed. Which I I'm currently messing up my quick swim. I'm not gonna try quick swim here. I don't want to. Land on those. Cheap Cheeps! I took over Cheap Cheep. Oh, this looks really cool. This looks pretty damn badass. And at least now that I'm a fish, I don't need to worry about oxygen. 
You know, fish never have to worry without. I have to worry about air. Where was surface? There we go. You got a moon. Cheap, cheap crossing. Apparently, there's hundreds of moons in this game. I can't wait to collect every single one of them. The cheap cheeps are. Oh, oh. Cheap cheeps are fast. And. semi difficult to control. Compared to Mario, at least. I'll just need to get used to them. Oh, that's cool. You do do we echo the dolphin jump. Nineteen of fifty. We're fairly. Oh, look at this guy. He he's like a a lapras with a, a moon on his back. Dory backrider. Yeah, the, the water animation is like the game is sixty frames per second. And I have the stream set to 1080p, 60 frames per second, so it looks gorgeous. And it, it's a first-party Nintendo game. They always do right. I think we're going to leave the cheap cheap for now. We'll do some exploring as Mario. Oh, I don't want to be a Goomba. They've got like weird wigs or oh whoa okay you can stack them that's gonna come in really handy except for when I can't stack them because I can't jump up like that okay you're mine you're mine we're going for we're going for tree we're a tree stack we can't do anything with this tree stack because <laughs> we're getting chased oh, I'm gonna get sandwiched. That almost went poorly. Okay. Nope, that didn't work. I have, I have a better idea. I'm going to use my, my lead skills. No, I didn't do it. Come on. Okay, this is bad. We need health and hearts and everything. Which we cannot find. We're getting out of here. Escape to the fish pond. I can see something on the other side of the picture. This so this one we we found one of these previously, but we couldn't get into it. It's going all Mario 64 style. Jumping into pictures for levels. But let's see what else we can find in the meantime. Uh, what? <laughs> Who? <laughs> um, I'm just looking at stream chat right here, and I have no idea what's happening, but okay, cool, guys. John, okay, fair enough. <laughs> I have no idea what that is, but... Oh, wow. This, this is the one we saw earlier, at the start of the stream, when we looked up, and we thought it was the... The Flying Pyramid. Get all of them. More coins. Southwestern floating island. Well, that's pretty cool. They can actually float between them all. You sent my viewers. Are, okay, cool. Thank you for that, John Evo. I have no problem with that whatsoever. Welcome to everyone who just joined. <laughs> Now I have to do this without messing up. Wait, I still don't want... Oh no, I got my health back. This is fine. This is fine. Oh, I got trolled. They're little Goombas. Okay, so we need to figure a way up top. Let's see if a triple jump will get up. One, two, three. No, that's not going to work. This is not good. I need my help. Oh, it doesn't give you help back the second time. Okay, we, we can come back. We can come back. 
Oh, there's another zipper. What's in this one? Lots of coins, fair enough. Oh, whoa, we got cheered. What the hell was that? You got a moon, end of hidden passage. That's pretty good. Listen to music. Not not the not the in-game or not so much the in-game music, but not the, the ambient music. It sounded like there was some sort of weird extra music playing. I wonder can we catch can we catch this guy? I feel bad now, I just hit him in the face. Okay, that's not gonna work. We're gonna need a cheap cheap for this. There we go. Infinite water, or infinite water, infinite oxygen. This big, like, underwater dome looks awesome. No, cheap, cheap. Stop being too fast. How do we get in? Oh, it's open. Another part of the moon. Two of five. Oh, we're gonna need to break those. Sorry, cheap, cheap. You're gonna have to wait. I should have broke the other one. I can't see. Oh, they respawn. Oh, right into the wall. Lovely. The one time I get the... The quick swim. Proper. There's more on the, the far side. I don't have enough oxygen to do it, though. Hey, you can breathe in here. That looks pretty cool. Uh, let's see. I wish they would have added Luigi in this game and have an option to play as him. I'm curious, if you play multiplayer, is the second player Luigi? Or is it just another Mario? Come on, Cappy. Pull them out. Oh, I'm not going to have enough oxygen. Swim up. Go! Oh, I'm not going to make it. No, I'm in some... I can't get into whatever this is. It's a dome of some sort. Okay, we got it. We got it. I don't know how that didn't hit me. I had no oxygen for like the longest time. I can't stand that monster's vile henchman. They stole our beloved lock lady dress. Well, don't worry. We'll get it back. Now, this is the little thing that trolled us, isn't it? The little dome. That's cool, I can just use it as like a first person view to look around. Look, we've got another broken piece of the thing over there. Can we drop in through the top of it? We can. So it's just another normal. The second player is Cappy. Okay, I didn't realize that. How would that work? Can they just like control themselves when they want to be thrown? Who put this rock here? Isn't it dreadful? Of course it is. It's a rock. It's it's in my way. That's, wait, wrong button. Okay, I can't break it with this. I probably need to come back later. It's the beauty of it. There's so much exploration. It really shows that Nintendo can do so much when they put their mind to it. Ape it pipe. Oh, this one's a music note. What the? Oh, it's another one of these. Come on. We get the whole thing. Missed some of it. Go back. Oh, no, you have to do it all at once. Okay. We're gonna have to be quicker on this one. Oh, we have to leave and come back because the, the platform's gone. Here we go, we've got this mastered. 
No, no, that's a bad start. Oh, that's terrible. Uh, can I make it? No. Right, third time's the charm. Here we go. Yes! And we get ourselves an 8-bit power moon. Almost called it a power star. <laughs> Taking notes in the cliffside. You've become, quite, you've become quite skilled at being flat. Well, I don't know about you, Cappy, but I grew up with Mario being flat, so... It's second nature to me. Now we're gonna go back in and... Explore this weird... Underwater dome. And accidentally get a... A piece of a... a broken moon at the same time. Oh, I thought that was a lift. I suppose it's a it's a passage. Hmm. How are we going to get across the? Well, oh, I suppose we can. Oh no! Wrong button. I I did a dive by mistake. I meant to do a a butt stomp. Okay, we need to hit it once more and bounce it right across. Oh, that didn't work for some reason. A power moon inside a random crate. Was that crate glowing? I didn't notice if it was. But where did it go? It's okay, it's over there. We have plenty of time to to get up. I don't think it's going to disappear, but we just have to figure out a way up. Oh, the, the motion controls might actually come in handy here. As an... Wait, as an upwards troll? Any second now, as an upwards troll? Maybe? Okay, we're just going to jump and do it. I tried motion controls, I'm sorry, but you just weren't working for me. This is why I don't like motion controls. <laughs> okay, so we're definitely going to have to go across there. But what would be the best way across? I'd say from, from the opposite side. Oh, I didn't even see them there when I was... Okay. I don't know if we can make this, but we're going to try it. Yeah, we can make that. That's easy. We Oh, look, there's a There's a little gap and oh, okay, that's a level or an extra area or something. I'm not going in there yet. And then I almost jumped circles around it. What's in the box? I wonder if that's an RGT85 reference. What's in the box? What's in the box? Uh, let's see. Throw your hat halfway and then jump on it to make long gaps. Yeah, I... I oh, that's a good point, actually. Because what, what we, the only way I've done it in the past was like that and just ran onto it. Instead of throwing it out over a ledge and then jumping onto it. That's a great idea. I never thought of that. And uh, let's see. I hate the fact that they've added some motion control enemies or elements in this game. Yeah, I'm not a I'm not the biggest fan of it. Like so far, you've already seen there a minute ago when I got screwed kind of by them. I'm just gonna try it. Let's see if I can do it again. Nope. I'm trying to do the, the up version here. There it is. Okay. That's getting a little bit better. But still it's just it's so kind of flow breaking. Oh, so it's these lads with the with the music. 
<laughs> I don't even want to attempt to try that, but you're too late. We already got the lock lady dress. And I even, it, he sounds like one of the Sims talking. And it even matches the boss's tuxedo, so no way we're giving it back. This one looks kind of like Goofy. Let's see, can I hit it back at him? Oh, maybe I can. Oh, I see what I have to do. Stomp him. Okay. We, we got it. We got it. Dash, dash, dash. Here we go. Can we make it? That's the beauty of the shadow. You can see Mario's shadow. Running circles. Can't catch us. Who wears a buzzsaw hat? Well, I suppose Oddjob from James Bond had like a razor tipped hat. Come on, one more time. One more time. Got them mad reflexes. <laughs> Get wrecked, buddy. Will it be a multi moon? It's a multi moon. We haven't found a shop yet, though. Not in, in this one, at least. I'm sure most of the, the bosses in the early game are a joke. After all, you want to get used to them and kind of ramp the difficulty up. Gwyneth Paltrow's Halloween costume this year is that said box with her here inside. What? I have to take a look at that. <laughs> I'm worried about those two. Let's get after them. Oh, they, fi they fixed the, the stairs. Splendid. It looks as though he's collected enough power moves. We can make our way to the next kingdom now. But we're not going to just yet. Take picture of hint art. Do I have to go back there and take a picture? Or do I have to take a picture of this now? Uh, let's see, go to home and album to check it at any time. Let's try this. Now I realize that's just getting us to take a picture of... Oh, there's a Lakutu. Let's see what he wants to do. Lower and raise line. Come on, fish. You know, you know you want to. I never thought I'd be fishing in a Mario game. Oh, I thought I had him. I felt it vibrate just a little. Come on. You know you want to. I don't even know what the purpose of this is, but hey, we're going to figure it out. Come on, grab it, you know you want to. I'm just gonna wait for a sec, see if he can, see if he'll grab it. Let's move around just a little bit. It looks like he's going for it, is he? Maybe not. He's, he's going straight for it. No, he's... He hates me. Now, I need to figure out... Wait, I, I have a better idea. This one might work. If I capture the big one... And then build myself up with these. Can I make it up if I jump out? Yes, that is brilliant. We finally got them. Now we 
still need to explore more in the big ocean. As well as that weird door we found in the cliff up top that we didn't actually go in and explore. And a rock is gone here too. I love how the music just transitions. Oh my god, there's there's too much content in the game. There's too much open area, there's too much everything. Oh, listen to, the, listen to remix music. It's like a modern underwater version of the underground music from the original games. I want to fix it, I really do, but it's just so heavy. So, do we have to push it? Oh, we can move it as Cappy. So what am I trying to do here? No, so I probably need to get it to fall in a certain way. Oh, I do, look. I need to make it so that it's kind of like a small little house. So we need to face the two of them forward. Oh, it makes perfect sense. It shows you what way it needs to sit by looking at the bottom of it. So if I can get, just get it upside down. I'm terrible at these types of puzzles. I always get them the wrong way around. So I want it to go... This way? No, that's not right. See, this is what always happens. I get it in the right way, in a different position. And now, let me see. No, that's not going to work. it either. <laughs> it's like I said, I'm ter- Oh, wait. There we go. We got it. And she gives a moon for it. I'm terrible at rotation puzzles like that. A successful repair job. I was hoping there might be some purple coins or something behind. We're doing pretty good on the purple coins. 41 of 50 in this world. So now back we go inside the... Uh... Oh, look. Wait, there's a zipper. We didn't open the zipper, did we? We need oxygen. I don't think we opened this one. No, I don't remember this, this being here. Let's see. Uh, interesting how you have to how you have to have the ability to figure things out like a modern day Colombo. Uh, trust me, I know what Colombo is. I'm I'm old, unfortunately. Uh, and one more thing, the usual Colombo catchphrase. Oh, I wasn't expecting that. I was expecting it to open to, like, be a huge wall jump area. It's a keyhole. I haven't seen a key in this game at all so far yet. Oh, this is a big one. Get unzipped. Okay, there's still plenty of, of ways to go, especially over there. I don't want to risk jumping that yet. I don't think I could make that jump, unless I did a long jump. We'll give it a go. Oh, actually, no, you know, we won't give the long jump a go. What we will do is... Oh, okay. I was going to jump. I was going to throw that out there and jump onto it and bounce across. But apparently, we have a secret wall or secret 
hat hidden across. This works. Wasn't expecting to see that there. There's another smaller one inside it. I thought the game trolled me there for a second. I thought it was like a, a, a trick to kill me. Super secret zipper. <laughs> when that just fell, I thought I was doomed. That's good. So I'm, I'm curious, now that I think about it, because we're still getting more powers, I was going to call them power stars. I, that's a habit I will never break. 30 years of Mario will never be undone in two days. But I think the power moons on the left, the top left corner, I think they're, that's how many we need to go to the next world. That's my theory behind it anyway. I could be wrong. Beautiful coins. Shame they weren't purple, but I still won't say no to a coin. What the hell? So there's a key in the middle. I'm curious, if I get the zipper on the far side and bring it all the way down, will it open and let them all drop to their doom? Give it a go. Oh, okay, you pick up the key to unlock that one. Oh, <laughs> get wrecked, everyone. I should get an achievement or something for that. Well, I suppose the Switch doesn't have achievements, but you get the idea. Should get something special for, for unlock it all or kill it all of those all at once. Unzip the chasm. That was a fun little area though. It was very different given the fact that everything was zipper related. Oh, back to the water. Okay, so where were we going? Didn't we see the final piece we needed? But I can't remember where it was. Thank you, Traveler. Whoa. This is... Oh, okay. There's... We got a quicker way down. Wow, this is really deep. I don't know if I'm going to have all the oxygen for this. And then trying to get back out won't be too fun either. Just waiting for Sonic music to kick in. Dun 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 dun. Oh, this is bad. Go, go! Oh, we just made it. Is that Captain Toad from Super Mario 3D World? It is! Mario, fancy meeting you here. That's right, it's me, Captain Toad. I'm traveling the world looking for power moons. I didn't even know he was in this game. Swimming with this backpack is tough. I don't even know how I made it here. Yeah, that's true. I barely made it here. But I discovered a power moon. Here, you can have it. Score! Let's go swimming, Captain Toad. It's so quiet down here. I wonder how I'll get home. Well, there's a pipe there that will probably bring us up top, so that'll probably give us a go. As much as I love the Mario franchise, I think Nintendo should give the series a little break and focus on their lesser-known franchises. I don't mind, because we only get a proper Mario game once every, like, couple of years. Like, when did Super Mario 3D World come out? I, it's been, like, four years, maybe. I, I don't even remember. So it doesn't feel like they work it to death. She's a pot of... I was planning to grow flowers, but I lost my seed in a spiky tunnel. Okay. I don't think we've seen a spiky tunnel, have we? We got an 8-bit cat Mario, though. Give us a heart. Coins. Not a problem. 
I was not expecting that to be there. Oh, we're gonna have to shimmy along the ledge. Can we just hang on the side? Yes. Hopefully Mario's grip doesn't give out. 44 of 50. That's gonna be two, we just need to find two more sections of, what is this? Welcome, we're so glad you came. When will our beloved lock lady dress be found? Oh, this must be their shop. But yeah, in regards to, to working on their other franchises, I'm glad to see that Metroid is making a comeback. Hopefully we'll get an F-Zero and a proper Star Fox. You may know that coins come in two kinds, gold coins and purple coins. Oh yeah, so this is this is something we already know. We have some new products, so let's see what we can get with, with here. A life up heart. I'm not gonna buy that, even though I probably should. Power moon for definite. You got a moon. Shopping in Lake Lamode. I accidentally jumped up on the counter. Imagine that. It's it's like those people who went to McDonald's and jumped up on the counter looking for Szechuan sauce. I just jumped up and I was like, give me power stars. I keep saying power stars. Keep saying stars. Give me power moons. A pickle Mario. So fashionable cap. Hell yeah. We oh, we can afford the boxer shorts. Comfortable breezy boxers in a vibrant mushroom-like pattern. Now, I'm posing this question to you right now, stream chat. Do I buy the boxers or do I buy the trendy outfit? So I'm gonna wait here for a good like 20 seconds or something so that the stream chat can catch up with the actual stream and let me know. Do I buy the boxer shorts or do I buy the regular outfit? Because we have enough for them. <laughs> we all know there's a the big controversy around Mario's nips at the moment, so. Do we want to swim and run around in whatever, whatever this uh, underwater world is? Lake world, I believe it was called. The Lake Kingdoms. Okay, so I'm seeing, I'm seeing calls for buying the boxers. This, <laughs> I, I think I'm going to do it. Okay, boxer shorts it is. <laughs> You'll be wearing the boxer shorts out? Of course I will. Why wouldn't I? <laughs> it doesn't fit with the sombrero. I'm going to need to change hat. Actually, first off, before I do, I'm going to see what we can buy with the purple coins. So fashionable, you want to wear them on land. Fans of the universally loved Dory have been clamoring for a quality reproduction like this. It's designed just to feel just like the real thing. See, I don't know what these these last ones are for. It's not like we can carry them around or anything. But I will wear this. I'll probably actually have to change soon now that I think about it. If there's another area in this world, like there was in the, the desert world, I'm going to have to dress like them to get into it. But we're doing it. We're, we're rocking out. Rock out with the nips out. The display window is so sad and empty, but we won't let this get us down. So this is where the dress was displayed. It makes sense. It, it is a, a dress mannequin. We'll have to get it back. Yeah, look, this is probably it. This is probably the door we need. If you travel all the way to the Lake Kingdom, you should dress for the occasion. To get into the Lock Lady dress display window, you'll have to dress like a swimmer. Travel here. Oh, okay. This apparently counts as being ready to swim. I can't take it over. 
I can't butt stomp it. It makes sense that it's glowing because of what it is, but that there's actually nothing to do with it just yet. We can always come back. We still had the up up top. There was the the extra place for us to go in through a door. Let's get these coins. Oh, let's get the coins while we were in. Oh, there's more. These ones are blocks. We still need the, the final piece of the broken moon as well. I don't remember where it was. I know we saw it at one point. Oh, there's a door in this one. That's craftily hidden. Ah, you found me. Very clever. You can have this as a reward. Our secret little... I think that was possibly the easiest moon I've ever got. <laughs> Walk in and find someone. So it's official. Um, it's pretty much as expected, but I love this game. What is the secret you're seeking? I know it, I know it. Haha. -ha. He's a talker to. I can't tell you where. Well, he didn't say where, but I can't tell you, but I'll give you a clue. Found with Lake Kingdom Art. It's hiding somewhere and no peeking. Go find it, go find it. Skakaw. Skrakaw. Whatever it was. But I think that's the one we've already found. I think that's the one that was in the bottom of the fish pond. Because the one in the bottom of the fish pond was... It was, it had artwork. You can get up to the roof through that shaft. Oh, we've already been up here, haven't we? We get all our cheers there. Come on, Mario. Of course, it would give us one of them. Now, wasn't there wasn't there something that we saw as we were swimming up? It look there. That's it. We need to go back out and get those. And super butt stomp. Oh, I didn't mean to land in that. Because everything is super when Mario does it. It's super Mario. Super butt stomp. Super nips. Super everything. Okay, so 47 of 50. We only need one little group more. And then we'll have all of them for this world. Although... Oh, there's our... There's our fifth piece. No, camera, don't change. I think I saw another secret over here somewhere. I think if I stomp this... Oh, it's only coins, okay. I was expecting something a little bit better, but... No! Go back in. Take control of the cheap sheep. Moon shards in the lake. So let me... We're going to take a quick look around again. Oh, is there, are they the ones we need? No, we already have them. We came out of there. Out of the way, please. Is that a... A scarecrow? Couldn't remember what it was called for a second. Oh, okay.
What? What are we... Fl oh! I didn't even see this spawn down here. Okay, so we need to get down here very, very fast. So we just keep doing butt stomps. Right, gotta go fast. Sorry, Sonic. Come on. Yes, we got it. I didn't think we were going to make it with a little mess up at the start. Okay, up top we go. We still have that one wall. Or one zipper doorway. Why do I keep jumping like this? I keep pressing the wrong button to swim. But also in the meantime, I have to keep an eye out for the final section of purple coins. Oh, no, no, that's not what I meant to do. There we go. That's what I meant to do. Hopefully this one has the coins in it. To be honest, I'd rather get the coins than a, than a star. Or a star, a moon. Just because I could, I'd be able to completely have all the coins and not worry about it. I think I have to climb onto it? Yes. Oh, you can't take them over. Oh, that's bad. That, oh, no, never mind. I meant to do that. Perfect. Not a problem whatsoever. to jump over this now oh that's a that is dodgy oh, oh. Got it. it's all about the precision oh no that's oh it's going up I thought it was gonna go fall down that was too close Oh, look, I just noticed there's a, a little ledge on top of where that goes up. There's three coins in the area and you and I missed them. Oh, you troll, not telling me where they are. Don't worry, it's good, I, I can find them. I can find them. It's all about that exploration and figuring stuff out for myself. moon jump grab and climb some more now let's this is gonna be dangerous but I'm gonna try it anyway oh yeah pro level Mario right there jump grab cling and climb So there was actually a couple of moons in there, which was nice. Now, the big thing is to find the ones I missed. Oh no, no, catch on, catch on. No, Mario, why? Let me look around. Actually, I need to get back up top. Because if I can get up top, I can get a good vantage point, a good view, look around. Find those coins I'm missing and then move on to our next world. Oh, wait, is this, no, this will be another heart, never mind. Another heart, another, this will likely be another moon, yeah, moon, there it is. 
Oh no, that's not what I meant to do. No, it fell. Once I got the timing right. And we got it. Beautiful. Lake Kingdom Timer Challenge Timer Challenge 2. I wonder if they're up there. No. There doesn't seem to be a way up. Hmm. Don't see them, but we're we're not done yet. No, wrong button. I keep mixing up the stomp with the, the dive. Now, it's another one we need. I have a feeling it's something to do with that rock over there, actually. I completely forgot that rock even existed. Until I just saw it over there. I'm going to go over and have a look. Don't worry about those blocks for the moment. After all, they're only blocks. I don't remember that being there. Still nothing I can do with this yet. Well, that's a that's a future problem. Hmm. Looking around, I don't see anything. Wait a second. Oh no, we, that's the challenge we already did. This game's trolled me. Successful troll, Mario. Successful troll. Well, that's something for later. Gotta love that replayability factor. So let's see what our next option is. If we just go to, was it Woodland World? Forest World? Something World? Or if they're gonna give us new options. I need to stop leaning forward. It's playing havoc on my back. The Odyssey has been powered up. 46 we have. Reach the wooded kingdom now. Maybe Bowser is there. I have a feeling this is going to look like Cascade Kingdom, with possibly less waterfalls and just more trees. He's going to give us some. He's going to give us some little refresher on some controls we already know. I can already tell. <laughs> Ever heard of a wedding with a stolen dress? Let's get after that tactless fiend. Yeah, he's going to try to tell me some more skills. Spin troll. We already know this one. Next look at his read on, on the wooded kingdom. According to this guy, there's a giant greenhouse that's filled with flowers. It's famous for its beautiful soiree bouquet. That would explain why he what he's trying to steal. Think about this, we're already a few kingdoms in. Steam gardens. We're already a few kingdoms in and we haven't even seen New Donk City yet. Which is still an amazing name. <laughs> oh, Piranha Plant. Our first Piranha Plant we've seen in this game. Road to Sky Garden, though. Oh, it's this place! Wait, do you hear something? No. I... I don't hear anything. No, Kai, I didn't get the coins. I missed them. 
we can always go back later. When I figure it out. Because I'm going 100% the crap out of this game. Oh, these ones are cool. They're like nuts or something. Like lug nuts or whatever. I gotta be careful running along this. I don't want to fall off and die. I forgot Mario has the Naruto run. Six. Hopefully we can we can get better on this one. The Universal loved to sue Nintendo. They've done it before and they lost. Oh, there's some green. Ah, uh, green. There's some purple coins off in the distance. It's funny, I, I'll always forever call them purple coins. Simply because, one, Mario uses coins. And when you look at Yoshi's Island, Yoshi's Island used red coins. That was kind of introduction for proper extra coins. I mean, I know Mario had silver bonus coins as well. But... Yoshi's Island really made them the big deal. So they, the extras will always be coins. It's something that's going to take a while for me to break the habit for. Oh, we can go into the tree. As long as... If they start saying Deku Tree, I'm going to lose it. Is that a, a hood? No, it's a rock. <laughs> oh, it's a tree, tree stump. What is this? Uh, it's more hint art. Okay, um, we'll take a picture of it for later. It's obviously hint art for something to do with back in the whatever they call it, back in the desert place. It's too quiet. Oh, wow. How did I miss that? Oh, I suppose I was running straight for what I thought was a rock. Now, let's see if we can take these over. No, oh, okay, these are the, the inhabitants. Recent events have initiated my panic and spin routines. Panic and spin! A servant of the monster is illegally accessing our flower supply. During the last watering cycle, an unidentified object flew by. Okay. But we definitely know he's here. Or at least one of his goons is here. There's these rocks again. You win this round. Giant strange rock that I don't know what to do with yet. I think I saw the shop back here. He's got a boombox. Oh, it's Peach. Oh, we couldn't hear her in that one. Cardboard boxes everywhere. It's like an 80s driving movie where you just have to go through all, knock over all the cardboard boxes. Initiating first greeting dialogue. Yes, yeah, so we know there are two types of coins. Oh, we could be like Indiana Jones Mario. Oh, there's lots of them here to choose from. Hmm. Scientist or explorer? I like the look of the, the explorer one a bit more. We just need a few, we need to find at least one more stash of purple coins. But these ones are blue. Wait, what did that say? Oh, wooded king. I thought it said modded kingdom power moon. This 
there's going to be so many different colors of them all. You got a moon. Shopping in Steam Gardens. Gabe Newell would be proud. Shopping in Steam. A mechanic outfit. I'm going to buy some stuff. I'm not going to wear it, but... It's just to mark him off the list. I still run around with the nips out until I get... Until I get enough. I want to buy that explorer suit. And I will wear the explorer suit when I get it. I'm calling hacks. Shenanigans. There's no hidden passage or anything behind a waterfall. That's another sphinx. Oh my god. He's, is he going to give us a, a really basic riddle again? Do you know of Amiibo? Of course I do. You may try holding right and tapping an Amiibo on the NFC touch point. A desirable outcome is all but certain. You know what? Next time I stream this game... I'm going to have my amiibo, or at least some of them, beside me. Oh, we can get a rabbit. Come here, rabbit. Come here. Get back here. Oh, not what I was expecting at all. Caught hopping in the forest. I was trying to catch him and maybe run really fast or jump really high. But yeah, I'll have some of my amiibo next time. We are programmed to grow flowers. The flowers are programmed to grow. Deep. So let's see what kind of bust-ass riddle he'll give us at this time. Greetings, traveler. And to your hat as well. Can you answer my riddle? What does the monster want from this kingdom? He wants flowers. You are correct. Perhaps that wasn't much of a riddle. Anywho, proceed. Yes, this is what we wanted. But Mario won't grab the ledge for some reason. Okay. Because we do backflips. Backwards, okay, that was the whole point of, of this one. Backwards somersault. If you're looking for the easiest way to get onto somewhere that a regular jump won't quite reach, stop, crouch, and press B to do a backwards somersault. At least this way, because I'm not in the middle of a boss fight, I can actually stop and mute the mic when I need to cough. Oh, give me one second. I'm currently wrapped up in a jumper that I need to... Much better. It's getting too warm. And just just picking up... Oh, look. They're on top of the tree. Just picking up the, the Pro Controller actually triggered uh, one of the, the motions... For all you fans of Mario's nips out there, I gotta I gotta say, I'm sorry, because it is time to go exploring. An explorer outfit style. Which amiibo am I thinking of? Oh, also, welcome back, Pixel. And let's see. Yes, I read the sign after doing it, and I, I completely pawned it. Uh, what amiibo am I thinking of using? Well, most of the amiibo I have probably aren't compatible with this game. I only have about... I think 10 amiibo. Most of them are Fire Emblem amiibo. I have one Animal Crossing amiibo, two Animal Crossing amiibo cards. I have a Yoshi amiibo, a Link amiibo, and I've got Samus. Uh, is it Zero Suit Samus or Samus? I think I think it might be both. And I have the ter one of the 30th anniversary Amiibo. You know the 8-bit Mario ones? I've got one of those. I think if anything, the 8-bit Mario one would probably work. But it's such a hype... Oh, we can't walk in that. I thought it was water. I'm covered in paint. What is this? Super Mario Sunshine? But at the same time, because Super Mario Odyssey is such a high-profile game, it wouldn't surprise me if all the Amiibo worked in it. Also, listen to that funky jive music. Oh, it's this guy. He's going to give me another hint. 
What is the secret you're seeking? I know it, I know it, haha. <laughs> Can't tell you, but I'll give you a clue. Elevator escalation. That sounds like a Donkey Kong level. It's hiding somewhere, no peeking. Go find it, go find it, Skrakaw. It appears the monster's minions are still on top of the tower. I worry about the flowers we were growing there, but what can we do? Well, I'll get them out of your way. And then you can go back to growing your flowers. Ground pound jump. We already know this one. Jump, yeah. Jump after the ground pound to give us the boost we need. No, I didn't mean to read that. There it is. Our ground pound jump. Come on, camera. Get it. Get it. Perfect, we made it in. Oh, what's happening? My... There we go. My chat went all crazy. Oh, no! Uh, let's see. Yes, welcome. All amiibos work. That's good to know. Oh, I made it. I made it. I recovered it. It was fine. That, I did not recover. Oh! I was expecting to instantly drop when I hit the water. Random thought. Cappy possessing himself. That's kind of weird. How could Cappy possess himself, though? He, he couldn't technically throw himself onto himself. Hopefully we don't make the same mistake. We just make a completely different one. There we go. No! Like a like a complete pro. Floating pipework ceiling secret. I noticed that because when I jumped up to get the three coins. I noticed that if you look at the ceiling here, oh wow, you can actually rotate the camera. You could see that there's two little, slightly different things. Capception, that's what it is. Cappy possessing himself is capception. In we go, in we go. Flooding pipeway. We got two of them, that's pretty damn good. How are we going to do this properly? Oh, okay, that wasn't too bad. <laughs> I thought it would be... <laughs> look, look at him getting hit in the head by the water. <laughs> Poor Mario. But I thought because of the the rapids and all and, and the waterfall that it would be the kind of thing that would instantly push us down. Oh no. That is oh they're coming back, it's okay. I thought I was gonna be trapped out there for a second. Not gonna go up there yet, because there's still a little bit we haven't explored just right here. Gotta love that funky music though. Oh, you can clean it up. Yeah, it's definitely Super Mario Sunshine 2 confirmed. Just leave that poison to me. No, shake. There we go. That gets all of them. Go Cappy. Who knew motion controls would actually come in handy? Now I'm expecting some sort of commendation or celebration or some sort of reward for doing this. 
I'm making the woodland, what is it? Uh, making wooded kingdom great again. Oh, oh, what the hell? What kind of weird powers do they have? Hold B to stretch. I was not expecting that. There's something up on top of there. I can see the shadow. Yep. Got them. Got that mad perception skills. Me and Mario games go way back. Oh no, you're too slow when you do that. Oh, that was so close. That's like a Deku tree. Or Deku C, Deku Nut, whatever you want to call it. Happy capturing Tiara would make more sense. It's That's true. That's true. They're both technically two separate entities, so one could try technically capture the other. Oh, I, wasn't, I didn't see him. He just kind of popped up. We haven't looked around this world yet, actually, have we? Road to Sky Garden. Oh wow, look at all that. It's poison galore. It's like... <laughs> it almost looks like a Splatoon map. Oh, is that a door? Mm, possibly not. How do we get up there, though? Interesting. Hmm. Oh wow, we can go all the way up there. Maybe we just have to drop down on top of it, if that's the case. Seems like it'll be a place for later. Anyway, let's forge on forward. Oh, I forgot the poison. Do I look like plant food to you? Do I have to shake the... Hmm, can I jump on his head? Oh, I landed right beside him and he bit me. That's cool, Bergthor. I appreciate that. Thank you very much for subscribing. Yes, you can jump on him. So, that is a good way to kill him. Well, it helps if I actually land on him. Instead of landing literally everywhere but him. <laughs> when Cappy's blocked by that, he it looks like he freaks out. Okay, I think I've got the whole purpose of that. When I throw Cappy at him and he eats it, he can't shoot out poison. So it gives us a second to jump on his head. Wow, we got another time trial. Is that a Koopa Troopa? Oh, it's a Hammer Bro. Okay, I, do I gotta fight him? This is like a Super Hammer Bro, because he's throwing fire. That was surprisingly easy. I thought it would be like a mini boss fight. Instead of just one hit. They're just land sick. That's one way of looking at it. I think the, the piranha plants are all sick because they're not actually coming out of pipes for a change. Hey, don't forget me. Where was he? Oh, that's right. He was on the... Cappy was on the... Training mannequin thing. Scarecrow. I almost didn't see that poison there. Now that I think about it, the fact that Ma Super Mario Sunshine never got a, a proper sequel, and it's all about cleaning off paint, could Splatoon be a, 
spiritual successor? That's a paint in the place. Or may maybe, maybe Splatoon is the the reason for Mario Sunshine. Oh no, they just keep respawning. That's not good. Can I go in here? I can. I don't know which way I want to go first, though. Well, never mind. There's no other way to go here. Break all the blocks. Get ourselves. Oh, is this going to be another star? Star moon! I'm telling you, it's a habit that's never going to be broken. I'm curious to see if by the end of this playthrough, just because there's, it's going to go on for so long and there's so much to do, if I will manage to stop calling them stars. It's like I've said several times now, 30 years of habit is not going to break this quick. 30 years of Mario games. Oh no. I mean, I'm, I'm pretty sure even in even when I played Super Mario Sunshine, oh no. I think even then, even though they're technically shines, I still believe I call them stars. Old habits die hard. Okay, that's, oh yes, a checkpoint. Beautiful, beautiful health, halfway point. Splatoon Sunshine confirmed, exactly. It's, it's go, we're gonna develop some sort of theory here that leads us to believe that all Nintendo IPs are somehow related together. We're gonna come up with some crazy theory. We've got Splatoon 1 and 2, we've got Super Mario Sunshine, and now Super Mario Odyssey. No, I didn't mean to go back in. Now we just have to figure out everything else. I mean, sure. Metroid Prime and... Hello. Oh, I could take this one. What the hell? Spit. Oh, this one shoots rocks. No, okay. It shot a rock a second ago, but not this time. Maybe if you throw a rock at it. I call them Shine. Yeah, <laughs> Shine Gav. That's true. I, I will say this for sure though, I'm, I'm not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure I still call them stars. For the most part. That I eventually broke, like, towards the end of the game. Which will probably be the case of, of this one too. Okay, this is a giant... A giant piranha plant. I, oh, I keep accidentally hitting it. Okay. That was not so bad. Yahoo! Moon Get wrote the Sky Garden. It's catchy enough to call them shines. That's true. I wouldn't mind it. These don't even... When you think of the shines from Super Mario Sunshine, they actually look kind of like stars. But these clearly look like moons, but I still call them stars. <laughs> Neat, we can use that to get across. This looks cool. Oh, except for the fact it's falling behind me. I need to dash more. Now, do we take... Let me see what this one's gonna do. So we've got another path that let's let's follow it along just for a second to see where it goes. Hmm. Is that that's the base of where we really want to go. So we're gonna go the other way. It would be so cool if Nintendo would add Cappy as Mario and Luigi characters, but at the same time it would ruin him. 
I see what you're saying. Like Cap Cappy is so far a, a good character, and he's really cool in in regards to what he does. But what makes him special, like you're saying, is that uh, it, like this is just his thing. Like this is his time to shine. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! And it would kind of take his his specialness away if they if they put him in everything or they started putting him in a lot more. But for all we know, maybe we'll get a, a like a Super Mario Odyssey 2 way, way further down the line with a return of Cappy. Cracked nut on a crumbling tower. Oh, is this one going to give us our... No, it's not. I thought it was going to give us our Naruto run that Mario so loves. It seems to only be when he's running down hills that he gives us a Naruto run. Now, where else are we going? Well, before we go up top, we're going to look around the bottom. And that was completely pointless because there's nothing down here. Open over. There's two of them this time. Oh, there's coins back out there somewhere. I might have to use good old this guy to get them. I don't even know what these are called. I can't really say good old this guy. Yeah, that makes sense, doesn't it? Yeah, this is gonna work. Oh, well, it works if I do it correctly. Oh, 44. We're actually almost done with the coins in this world, too. Watch it be like the, the previous world, where I'm missing, like, one, one section of them. Right, and up, and away we go. Let's see what's in here first. Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, I made it. Another moon. Not planted in the tower. But we actually need a lot based on the, the count on the left. I probably still shouldn't be this guy, but it's coming in handy. And there's a shadow of something here. A moon. That is... An extremely like cheesy pun, Burgot. But at the same time, like a, a cheesy pun and cheesy jokes and all are always welcome here. I'm the king of them, so expect a lot of them. <laughs> Sky Garden Tower. So this one is going to be our next boss fight. It's probably going to be the the blue guy in the, the ginger. He's the only one we haven't fought yet. Too late, chumps. We snagged the soiree bouquet already. Now, why don't you scram so we can grab the rest of the flowers as well? Or maybe I'll just make you scram. That's not particularly scary. Oh, wow. Oh, okay, that's not too bad. We have, we have this sorted. Oh, what a mess. Oh, we can we can deflect them away from us, at least, which is nice. And luckily, we, we still have this. No, it landed on his head. There we go. If you can time it properly, you can actually get it before he spits. Oh, I didn't even see the the rock there with the coin in it. 
stay away from me. Bang. It's probably a bit safer to wait till after he spits though. Because he kind of leans back and it's harder to hit his head. Sir Sick. <laughs> That's one way of, of calling him. We got more power moons. There was still that whole other area that we didn't have access to though. Remember when we were on the... Whatever we call it, the like binoculars thingy. So at least when we get up there. Because there was death. Yes, I was about to say there's path to the secret flower field. This must be the way to go and then. Never mind. Because I do remember there was purple coins that we just saw a second ago. Did I just see something land up there? I believe you did. Now we just have to figure out how to get up there. buy some more stuff you know I'm gonna buy these kind of things just because I still don't know what they do we will send it to the Odyssey so it's something to do with the Odyssey you do not possess sufficient coins oh I'm one short I don't want to change now though wait a second I can't afford all this stuff um, if I'm only missing six coins from here, six purple coins, that means I can't afford everything. What are these? Oh, what? I was not expecting that at all. The monster's minions must not discover a secret flower field. The entrance is just ahead, but we dare not attempt it. We need assistance. That's where I come in handy. Can I jump up here first? It doesn't look like it's high enough. Or it looks like it's too high for my jumps. Oh! <laughs> it goes so fast, it's hard to... To do properly. Here we go. Oh, it's a tank. That's very hard to control. Now I want to take over one of these tanks. Yes, I can. Aim and shoot. So that looks like my way up, at least. I don't know how, and I probably shouldn't destroy these. In case I need to stand on them. Actually, I know how I can get up there. I think I could probably use one of those extendy leg guys. Go, go, destroy it all. Oh, he can't get in. We've got more green coins. Uh, green coins. Pull the lever to receive a seed. I require time to prepare the next seed. Well, this doesn't look not obvious at all. Holy crap, it's Mario and the Beanstalk. How the hell am I supposed to get in there? I can't. Can I jump? Between one and the other? No, it's not enough. Maybe I can just fall into it. Or this might work. Oh, I can't throw my I can't throw Cappy. Okay, we can worry about those coins later anyway. Of 
forest charging station. Oh, this should be where I can drop down, actually. Is it? No, it's not. Recharge station is crowded. This this guy is wrecked. He's, he's all ruined. Please hurry. Is it my turn yet? I'm my turn yet? I'm consuming something. Thanks for the charge. Oh, lovely. I wasn't expecting that. I was expecting to do something cooler. Oh, there's a rocket up there. Well, that explains why these are here. I think we've... Have we used a rocket before? I think we have. I don't remember what it does though. Hold B to launch. It looks like a turret from Portal. Oh, we're collecting parts of the broken... Okay, they're just hanging there casually. I have a feeling that there's like hidden platform out there now. No, don't go back. I didn't mean to. I'm going to try it anyway. That did not work. Let me look back over there. I mean, if there's something there, then... No, it doesn't... Oh, there might be a different way to do it. But we'll figure it out as we go along. Oh, okay. This explains it. We can fly. And there's a, a piece of the moon up here. And we got it. Oh, wait. There's, is there more? There is. Oh wow, just stuff hidden underneath. That's pretty intricate. I wouldn't have thought of that. Yeah, that was that's pretty crazy. I really like the idea of these little mini stages. The fact that they they rely so he oh no. The fact that they they rely so heavily on like one mechanic that they can really focus on intricate and extravagant ways of using it. What is that? Oh, it's the enemies respawning. Okay. Wandering in. Thunderbirds Argo. What is... Does he look different? I think he's got a hat on. Let's see if we can land on there. We're going to see if we can build this up as high as we can. We got the last two. Can we can we jump? Oh well we we still successfully got it in a way. Oh it's a female one, okay. Thank you for the moon. The pink Goomba will give a power moon only to the goo okay, that makes sense. I ju I just read it now in the chat. So 
So luckily we figured out a way up. I still have to find... Oh no! Oh, this is kind of awkward to control while looking around and moving because of the motion controls. I had the same problem with Breath of the Wild when I was playing and using the arrows. Because I was trying to aim with the arrows and at the same time the motion controls were saying not today. Seven to fifty, and we know where the, the final few. Wait, I can't be right. It says there's only three more, but there's three ahead of us, and there's the ones we already passed. I needed to use the tanks to destroy that wall, didn't I? Oh, there might be another way around. Can we sneak it? Oh, this might require a long jump. Oh no! Oh! Oh god! Have to be careful with all these jumps. And look, here's even more. This makes even less sense. Oh, okay. It go the counter goes up when when you get them. Okay, now it makes sense. We have to swing between them. Let's go, let's go. Mario's the gymnast. He's basically everything, so... Oh, jump, jump, jump. And here we got another moon. Perfect. Secrets galore. Uh, let's see. Yeah, it's it's actually the same time here for me as well, Bergtor. It's uh, it's 5:26 a.m. in the morning here. Oh, lovely! It put us all the way back out here. We don't have to go back to hardware. If I do this correctly, I can actually get a kind of advantage. But at the same time, it wouldn't surprise me if they hid a secret somewhere that you don't need to be. So we actually will just destroy the entire thing. Yeah, look, there's a secret. This is where years of Mario style practice comes in. Mario, Sonic, whatever other games. Oh, but I needed, I still needed to leave some to make it over there. Or can't, no, wait, I might be able to drop down actually. Yeah, I can drop down. Behind a rock wall. I wonder why it gives the date of when you found them. The summit path. Oh, I didn't mean to hit him, I wanted to talk to him. If that slope is too steep for you, try enhancing your foot speed with a flower. So that's what they're for. Oh, we have coins up there too. We'll have to figure out how to get up, up there and get those. There's a moon over there. There's something else in there too. Oh, it's a... It's a checkpoint flag. See if I can get all of them at once. I can. 
Beautiful. We're gonna check around here though before we go. I think going up was the way to go. Oh yeah, we have an 8-bit cat peach. Doesn't let us down. Oh, we have a nice extra area. It's probably only gonna be a small little puzzle, but a moon is a moon. Or maybe it's more than a small little puzzle. Oh, that's right, we're still in the wooded world. Chasing after me. Oh, great, I know what this is gonna be. I'm gonna have to... Oh, that is very bad. Yeah, I messed that one up. Oh, I might... No. Okay. That's not good. I need to wait for all the enemies to respawn. I think. Actually, do I? No, let's follow the cross anyway. I was originally thinking I need to... I need to be... I need to control all the Goombas and make them into a tower. But it looks like that might not be the case. I had a feeling there'd be something hidden behind her. Oh, look at a big wall of goo. Oh, that's cool. You can, you can actually like wall jump between them. It even goes into the, the waterfall of goo. That cappy prolonged spin comes in really handy. Now we just gotta wait for this to come back up so we can we can continue on, get ourselves a moon. I think I hear it. Yeah, there it is. Oh, we do gotta make a jump for it though. Wouldn't surprise me if many people tried to get that and just accidentally ran off, expecting it to just keep going. Okay, so now we can go back out. Now I think it's time for us to run up the wall. Yep, it's wall time. Oh! Oh, it's awkward to control. Oh, there's a, a secret there at the very top on the right. It's another door. So let's see how this one is different. Oh, this one is like a combat one. Uh oh. Wasn't expecting to go down. Enemies everywhere. Bright, colorful, horrible enemies. It's okay, we're tank Mario. Hmm. Do I want to risk it to try go up and get those? I think I do because I don't want to forget about them. Yeah, 
right, land, land. Now the problem we have is no tank. Oh, he's back. There we go. We do have a tank. Never mind. Thank God we do. Jesus, look at all these ones. Sorry, right, though. I'm a tank commander. There's nothing behind us, though, is there? No, it looks like there isn't. Have I played Superstar Saga? No, the name rings a bell, but I don't recall having ever played it. Oh, Moon. Elevator Escalation. Was this the one that the bird was telling us about? He said elevator escalation. And it was technically a little kind of hidden secret one. The secret flower field is ahead. Do not share its secret location. I don't know what you're talking about. I didn't see anything. Well, there's obviously something hidden here. Extra round of bonus health. Oh, what the hell is that up there? Some, like, extra... new attack thingy. I wonder if we can shoot it. Oh, we can, we can... We have to hit the targets by the looks of it. Yep, breaks it down completely. Yahoo! We got another moon. Jesus, look at all the blue ones we have. Once in a blue moon. Doesn't really apply in this case. Since we've got so many damn moons. Defend a secret flower field. It's like we're going to get abducted. X-Files style. Of course I'm ready. Oh, we're not getting abducted. We're going down. Okay. He does technically have a UFO, I suppose. Oh no, it's taking all the flowers. Uh, how do I damage this, though? Interesting. I think I noticed on the outside there though which I can't rotate the view to get on the right hand side there it is there's the little the blocks hopefully we can make our way over onto the blocks Oh, they just had hearts in them. Hmm. Oh, we can take it over. Or maybe we don't. She kind of stumped at this. I 
I seem to miss this every time I try to hit it. So it doesn't look like it's something to do with this. Can we go in the middle? Oh, never mind. Flowers, flowers, flowers. Must have all the flowers. Oh, we knocked it upside down. Do not mess with me, biped. So it is some sort of big evil robot. Okay, now it's... Oh, wow. That suddenly changed. Let's see if we can hide underneath one of these. When it does its laser thingy. Hold B to... Oh, okay. I didn't think of... I didn't think I was still one of these. Oh, what am I doing? There we go. Oh, we can hit it from underneath again. Okay. Boom. Super headbutt. All right. Oh, he's got a, he's charging his lasers. Oh yeah. He's got a timer jumps to go over them. Oh, this one's even higher. More of the same. We just gotta be all crafty about it. What? I'm bouncing. How am I bouncing on top of it? Oh my god, he's moving them. He's trolling me. Okay, stand underneath the middle, and up we go. It's all just a matter of precision. Oh, underneath, it's what we want. Is this our final blow? Just like that. Nope, not yet. Still going. I'm curious to see if he'll do any ones that I have to duck under. Oh, that's a full-size one. Boom. Headshot. This should be it. Yes. UFO is wrecked. A multi moon. Once in a blue multi moon. Now, let's see what they're going to give us for this. Yeah. Or more specifically, what new world they will access for us. Hmm, smell those flowers. Before we do, the flowers have bloomed at 137% over average. Actually, I'm not going to spend money here because... Oh, wait, I, ha I was going to say because I want to save it for the next one. Then I remember these are coins exclusive to this world. But one thing I do want to do is I want to look around the Odyssey. See if I can find... There it is. Okay, so I was going to say, see if I can find the stickers of the places I've been and some of the items that I've bought. So we've got more than enough. We only needed 16 moons. We had like 20-something. Up to 71. So 
matter to next. We have enough power to make our way to Metro Kingdom. Time to cross that vast ocean. Metro Kingdom looked like one thing to me. New Donk City. <laughs> Mario's like that. He's like that one... What do we call him? The one country bumpkin finally making his way to the big city. To think that their precious soiree bouquet is stolen. We can't let that Bowser keep doing what he wants. Oh no, he's going to tell us more useful skills. Oh, we know this one. We use it a lot. Now then, let's see what there is to see in the Metro Kingdom. Goodness, what was that? Oh, it's Bowser's ship. be a major boss fight. I gotta say, Bowser's suit is exceptionally stylish. Cloud Kingdom, Nimbus Arena. So this is like a major story boss fight kind of thing. Wow, these clouds look really comfortable. They look like a mattress. A really comfortable mattress. Holy shit, Bowser's huge. Mario, I don't have time for you. I'm busy planning my wedding. Don't you know how stressful that is? Well, we're going to explore a way to stop you. So his hat is slightly more upgraded than Cappy. Oh, it's coming at me. It's coming at me. Okay, so we do have to do something about it. Oh, we can use it. Hell yeah. Come on, Bowser. Combo! Combo! Smashed him off the spiked wall on the outside. Oh, he's got three of them. But we know which one to actually hit. Yeah. Time to use your own hat against you. Oh! I wasn't expecting that. Get them punches in. Send them flying. Oh, he's got loads of them now. Oh, we're in trouble. Oh, you can hit them to restore hearts. Beautiful. Oh, where is it? Yes, we got it. Okay, Bowser, we coming for you. Oh, you can punch while walking. Okay, let's get him. Break his guard. No, I couldn't break it. Maybe I didn't press it enough. Or maybe that's just what's supposed to happen on this part. Let's find out. Get him. He's got a shield. Oh no, he's gonna hit me. Oh. Oh no, he's down. 
Is that what knows her chance to get it? Oh no, I've, I messed it up. Okay, so I got it. We dodge, he falls over, and we kick the crap out of him. That's an ultra combo right there. Killer Instinct style. I will say, Bowser's comb over is pretty slick. Fire! Oh, well, this isn't fair. Run, Mario. Oh, thank God, the Odyssey caught. Oh, no, the Odyssey didn't catch him. See what you're up against, Mario. So will the Nimbus recover? Or do we get dropped on some other world or the Lost Kingdom, the Forgotten Isle? That answers that. Yeah, it looks kind of broken down. I was expecting him to get up by himself. Oh no, the Odyssey's all busted up. We need some power moons to fix it. Let's get looking. We're back to yellow power moons. It's broken and won't move. We need power moons to fix it. Let's look around for 10 power moons. I think I saw some purple coins there a second ago. I did. There are leaves on this one. Oh, there's a key. Can we... No, we can't edge in and get it. Hmm. There might be another way to get it. Face the polar tree and... Okay, so we can grab on and climb up. I wouldn't trust trying to do anything crazy with all that poisonous goo just yet to get that key. Oh, that didn't even do anything? I was expecting it to release something. Oh, he just stole copy from us. You dirtbag. Oh, great. I'm gonna have to do this bit without Cappy. That's gonna take a little bit of getting used to. That should, there's another one of those blocks that hates me. Cappy should be my first priority. At least that way I can get extra abilities and skills and stuff back. Like these. I can't do anything with these. Oh, I can. I can drive them into the ground. I can poorly drive them into the ground, but still drive them into the ground, no less. Oh, what is this guy? He's got a spike on his head. I don't know why I tried that. I can't break it. I, I need... I need to be able to capture stuff. I'm coming, Cappy. Don't worry.
No, climb onto it. Not jump over it. Cappy's consistent crying reminds me of Baby Mario from from uh, what that other, what's that other game? Yoshi's Island. And over and away we go. Oh, I can't get up. Oh, it's crafty. Inside the stone cage. So I didn't realize we could actually do that. Uh, yes, I made the jump originally. But this makes way more sense. Swamp Hill. Oh, he just got away. Oh, nailed him from beneath. Whoa, thanks for the rescue. That was unpleasant and rather, rather pokey. I sure hope it doesn't happen to get... Don't say that, Cappy. Now to pluck up our spirits, let's go and collect some power moons. That's cool. With the way they move. And the way I get hit by myself. Now, will this let me get all the way across? It will. Can I make it? Oh, I can climb up the tree, so it doesn't matter. That's not gonna... No. Well, we can leave him there. We don't need him. Oh, there's ones underneath, too. There's purple, co uh, purple coins underneath. Oh, okay. I wasn't expecting that to be there. A propeller pillar's secret. I was hoping it would like knock us down a little bit to get the ones underneath. Oh no! Did I miss my jump? This is going to be difficult. Or not. Oh, that doesn't work. I must need to get something better to break it. Oh, I've got to go all the way back up now. Oh, can we capture these? It caught me. I can't get away. Oh, so we can... Oh, okay. We can lure them towards us. This makes perfect sense now that because there was a there was another one. There's the other section of blocks had what was probably a moon inside it. Here we go, these ones. Oh, there's a moon down there too. Wrecked rock block. Drop down. Below the cliff's edge. Oh, there's a way up. Okay. I, I was just going to try backflip up. Oh, no. That's the wrong way. We want to go on the other side. We're all 
all good on that front. So let's just get across. I might need to be one of these, actually. Oh, no! Not gonna make it. That was awkward. Oh, these things can't jump. Oh, wow, look, there's loads of stuff down the bottom. I didn't even see all that down there. Atop a propeller pillar. Collected half the power moons we need. Just five more to go. Oh, that's craft. Okay, I just realized something. Remember the key back at the start? This is going to be how we can get the key. Mountainside platform. I want to try this first. This is real crafty. Like, this is the kind of creativity and just overall badassness that you'd expect from a Mario game and from Nintendo. And that's why, even though they do make a lot of mistakes sometimes, when they do it right, goddamn do they do it right. You've got the enemies going from 2D to 3D as well. Avoiding fuzzies inside the wall. We're not going to worry about the extra coins. No, I wanted... To, okay, I was thinking I wanted to capture him. Now I can do all sorts of crazy stuff with these. Including go back and get that key. Oh, was there something underneath there? Yeah, there's something underneath the bridge. I just got a quick glimpse of it. Peeking out from under the bridge. The name's on some of these. All the way back at the start, wasn't it? Oh, I couldn't let go on it. Yeah, here we go. A nice little moon. Twist and turn up treasure. So we only technically need one more, but there was still loads of space to ex explore. So we're definitely going to. Oh wow, my controller is actually getting low on battery. It is one good thing about the, well, that's one of the many, many good things about the Pro Controller. The battery life on it's fantastic. And it's a good controller in general, short of maybe the D-pad. Okay, so we want to, we want to explore this way first. Oh, 
Oh, he's fast, but I'm faster. Spin it. Spin it in a circle. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, what? There's a... How are we supposed to get over there? Purple coins, though. No sign of a shop or anything yet. No, that was that was poorly timed. Aha, this is alarm towards me. That's right. Rush me, rush me, miss me. And there's moon number ten. We will still keep going on the mountain road. Well, there definitely has to be something out on that. Excellent, you've got all the power. We've got all the power moons we need. We can fix the Odyssey now. We're not going to do it just yet. We're going to keep looking around. Wall jump. Well, we already know how to wall jump. This is a pretty strange looking button, though. Oh, it's... Okay. The wall jump area. Whoa, there's loads of stuff up here. Rocky Mountain Summit. Oh, one of them is the shop. The glide on. I'm traveling all over to glide from all the highest places. This spot looks pretty good for a blood pumping power dive. Scree! He doesn't seem to actually do anything. Okay. Oh, I didn't mean to jump on him. Talk. Howdy. Oh, hey, Mario. I didn't expect to see you here. Exploring? Nah, I can't open a store. Nothing tops this location, right? Step on inside and take a look around. If you say so, Toad. Not the the best place I'd recommend to open up shop, but whatever. Get ourselves a heart. A heart? What am I talking about? This isn't Zelda. The moon. Shopping on Forgotten Isle. We dress like the Michelin Man. Well, we'll buy it, but we're not going to put it on. I like my explorer outfit. It's good to pick them up as we go. I know we can buy them where wherever, but it gets them out of the way. Now, let's see what's exclusive to this island. An aviator cap. Well, gotta keep those ears warm at 30, 33,000 feet. This jacket is how you let people know you're a pilot when you're not in a cockpit. Well, when in Rome. We gotta rock the aviator look. Aviator Mario. I'm gonna try to talk to him again. Oh, see, he's not actually doing anything. Oh, there's a moon up here. I was just trying to go up for a look. Enjoying the view of Forgotten Isle. Now. Oh, there's another one. Remember, we, excellent, we've got a, yes, I know, Cappy. When we were down over there, I didn't see that moon because it was hidden on the opposite side. I guess we're going back over for that then. What's the safest way down? Oh, okay. I wasn't expecting to see this here. Spin. Got it. Cave guard. It's, it's so cool that you can just decide, oh, you know, I'm going to take a quick shortcut down, and then it's like, oh, wait a minute. What's, what's all this down here? Secret cave hidden. 
Captain is missing. Captain Toad. Treasure Tracker. Oh, this is looking questionable. I wonder if he could have flown away. Because we did have that bird before. A butterfly's treasure. But there's a cat. Whoa. How do I... It says I already have those three coins. That's strange. Oh, I picked... I, yeah, I see it. I picked them up using one of those guys. Is that the Odyssey? Or... Yeah, it is. It's the Odyssey. Oh, it's a bird. So what secret is he going to tell us about this time? On a tree in the swamp. Okay, yeah, because that's not... I wonder. Oh, no, I was trying to get him to run down and blow that open, but it didn't work. It's probably still how you do it, it's just not... I just didn't do it correctly. Now, so we want to go and get that one in the desert. Not in, not in the desert, in the swamp. The one that was on the tree that we saw on the other side. So, I believe it was this way we got across with it. I love how he makes the accordion sound. Yeah, this has to be it. We should be able to stretch around and get it. Bada bing. On a tree in this... Maybe... I wonder if I go back to the bird now. Will he tell me of a different one? Because that would make a lot of sense. Oh, it just occurred to me. I think you can climb up those poles at the underneath the propellers. Maybe to get those coins underneath them oh no that's bad oh i f i wouldn't mind i landed on the ledge but i thought i didn't okay we're gonna we're gonna continue on exploring this place just a little bit for now Let's see if my theory was correct. Yeah, you can. This explains how you get the ones underneath it. I'll have to do it on the other side too. more here, wasn't there? I, I'm pretty sure there was more in this one. Yep, there is. Now, off to the new side that we've never been onto before. Oh, including a broken one. Cliff. Oh, it's a piece of the... That's kind of a scary look, isn't it? He's just looking at us with his big weird eyes and weird face and big dirty Italian mustache. So what we've got, three pieces so far. Four. I have a feel it's just on the other side, behind this tree. You're too obvious, game. You're too obvious. Okay, it's back there. We can get it on the way back. At 
This one is all crowding around me. Oh! Smack myself in the face. Ah, I, there had to be something out here. Oh, it's the it's Captain Toad again. Captain Toad, how did I get here? I was dropped by a giant bird. A different giant bird than my usual one. But it's been nice to rest here in the quiet. And I discovered a power moon for you, so that's good. As well as the get some rest, Captain Toad. As well as a huge amount of coins behind him. Oh no, he disappeared. I'm gonna need him to get back out. Thank God he recoils fast when you let go. Moon shards in the jungle. Well, that's our first proper preliminary, anyway, explanation, or explanation, exploration of the oil. So let's head back. Back to our odyssey. And I will say this, unfortunately, we're going to have to end the stream now in a minute. Because we've been on it for a while, and it's get I would say it's getting late, but it's getting early. And I kind of need to start my day in a little bit. But there will most likely be another stream of this later. But we'll cover all that in a minute, when we're actually going to end it. The Odyssey is repaired. Mario's all filthy. So will we stand out, still end up in the Metro place? Metro Kingdom, Metro World, whatever it was? We found just enough power moons to fix up the Odyssey, thank goodness. Seeing as how you've got to- oh, this again. We know the role. Now then, where were we? Ah yes, we were on our way to, our, to the Metro Kingdom. The whole kingdom is one vast city filled with skyscrapers. It seems it was built using the energy from power moons. So there should be lots of power moons. Oh, that's cool, it's got all like moon dust floating from behind it. Metro Kingdom. New Donk City. Wow, this place looks like the ghetto. There's a cool rain effect, though. The Scourge on the Skyscraper. That's a pretty elaborate looking city. Alright, we finally made it. Things don't look so good, though. Look! It's Bowser's ship. Let's go. Yeah, all the rain effects and the uh, just the way the rain hits the ground and it looks all really cool. And there's the rain dripping down the screen and all. That's pretty beast. But it's time to save. Made some damn fine progress. And on that note, we will close the Super Mario Odyssey software and leave this stream here for now. Like I said, I will most likely have another stream at some point later today with Super Mario Odyssey. It's just early, real life starting. God, real life sucks, doesn't it? But yeah, Super Mario Odyssey, holy shit, this game is amazing. It's easily one of the best Mario games in a long, long time. It's definitely, definitely up there with consideration for one of the best Mario games ever. If not the best. 3D Mario game ever. So, Super Mario 64 fans, come at me. I've played the game. I've 100%ed that game. You can't say I don't have a valid opinion on that. 
it's good. We have to see. There's more that needs to be explored, more that needs to be learned, and we got to figure absolutely everything out. But in the meantime, in the meantime, we still have to just finish the game, then go back and explore and do everything. So until then, and until whatever comes out in whatever next stream, I want to thank everyone who's joined me in the chat tonight, just watching the game. If you've been talking away, if you've been shooting the shit with me, helping me out, or just being a nice silent protagonist. Either way, thank you guys for all of that. Because without you guys, I'm just sitting here playing a game by myself. So, you guys make this what it is. And, like I said, other than that, I'm just sitting here talking to myself, playing, playing Mario. So, peace out everyone. Thanks for being beast in the stream chat as usual. And I will see you guys next time on Super Mario Odyssey. Most likely, later today. Peace out, guys.